Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where everybody having elemental weaponry blinding me. We're on our way. Down. Attention. Uh all personnel must vacate the facility immediately. Listen. Something doesn't want to Listen, appear. Minerva. I don't think it's Minerva. Maybe it is. What exactly was this place? Seen anything like it before? No. The code cracking facility? There. That's our way out. Yeah, the door? Alright, I thought there'd be something in here, but... Error. Unauthorized oh, Initiating facility lockdown. Stay oh, what's going on? It's so spooky! Oh my gosh! Oh, well, at least the emergency lights work. <laughs> what just happened? Minerva's definitely here, and I think it's trying to keep us out. I'll scout ahead. See if there's a way to get us in. Get out. You sure we shouldn't come with you? Well, yeah, Minerva could be dangerous. Let me make sure it's safe. This is done. Is, is, okay. is this gonna keep happening? We'll be right here if you need us. Like, is this gonna keep happening? Like, I bring people with me and then leave them behind. Like, the whole point I thought was to like have Aloy, like, you know, learn that she needs to accept friendship and like help. And like, these people are not incompetent. Is the thing like Aloy is not the only person who can do these things. Like, I don't know. It just feels weird to keep bringing them and then not do anything. Um, so down was- oh, I was supposed to go up? Oh. Are you doing okay, Zo? I don't want to hear it. Zo? All this. Oop, nope. Minerva. Hephaestus. Huh? Gaia. This is what will help heal plain song? It's hard to explain. I mean- Nope. I barely understand it, but- Yeah. It's what Aloy's been looking for this whole time. Huh? I am trying to remember. Nope. Okay. How do I? How do I jump backwards? Like intentionally. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna scream. I kept w not wanting to turn around to jump off backwards, but apparently I was supposed to turn around to jump off backwards. I wish they would do it. Like I don't know. I feel like. I think Assassin's Creed did this, where, like, the, it wasn't, the way you jumped wasn't determined on, like, where your camera angle was, but where your character was facing, because I can compensate for that, like, all my brain will compensate for that, but, like, so, like, I'm trying to, like, press backwards from here, and, like, the button, like, the, oh, the circle to jump backwards, and, like, it wouldn't let me do that. I had to turn around like this, and, like, press, fo I think, forward, and then do the, do the circle, I don't know. But it's dumb. Like, just let me compensate for where my okay. body position is. I need to find where Minerva's hiding. Not where my camera's facing. I should look for a way to access the facility systems. Locked. Yeah. Well, these doors are sure not, sure not great. I'm gonna tell you. Don't be mean to me. You are not wanted here. <laughs> nope, sorry. You're not getting rid of me that easily, Minerva. Aloy is way tougher than I am. I'm, I'm terrified. Truly. Legitimately. What are all those cables in the center for? It looks like those cables connect to something above. Seems promising. I can find a way up there. Like when robots... Minerva's shutting me out. When robots get scary. I, uh, I get scared. There was a purple chest in that room, though. Like, I don't know, the robot voice? Ugh. <laughs> Actual heebie-jeebies. What about this one? Ooh, that's not what I wanted to do. I want to do this one. Nope. 
I don't know which way I'm supposed to go. I don't want to go. I can feel a draft above. No, no, no. Okay. Might be a way out of the shaft. Yeah, let's try this one. Oh, 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 really? 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 Why? Well, looks like another part of the facility. Door is locked. Oh my gosh. We could get tetanus being in here. Maybe I could look for a way in higher up the mountain. I'm just gonna like leave my friends there too. Like what the frick? Doesn't make any sense. Just going to abandon them. Like I'm sure. Awesome. If I can get Minerva to cooperate, I can merge it with Gaia. Finally bring her back, and we can start fixing the blight. The storms. Yeah, well, it's not gonna be that easy. Maybe she can help me figure out who those strangers in the proving lab were. Why did they have a clone of Elizabeth? Why did they want it back up? That's right, we still have all that to deal with. Pipes up there. Yeah, come on. Might lead me to a way back in. But how to reach them? Oh, those rocks look loose. I think I can clear them. Oh, or that. <laughs> oh. Oh. Alert. System core I'm not here to hurt you. Please don't be mean to me. We're just gonna oh, we're just gonna stick it on in there. You don't even have a backup for this. Yeah, uh, that was a that was a bold move. Minerva, I need the console, please. Access denied. It didn't used to be like this. Do you remember it? Anything? You were part of something bigger once. Something good. Oh, we still have the Colonel. Gaia. That's right. She can live again. But only if you give her the chance. I can't reboot her without you. The light cease. Oh. I think you'll disappear into her. Become part of her, like you used to be. Oh my yes. gosh! She's been like torn from herself. Thank you, thank you, Minerva. That would make sense, right? Like, she's not used to operating alone like this. She's Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. She's like alone and scared. Override activated. Restoring Minerva function to original code. Do you wish to initiate heuristic matrix? Sure. Here goes. Oh my gosh. No way it's this easy. I mean, it wasn't easy, but you know. Gaia. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. Uh, 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 a moment. Scanning data. Oh, snap. What? Scanning, oh, scanning my... So it is Aloy, not Elizabeth. My focus. We have much to discuss, but initialization of my heuristic matrix will not be complete for several minutes more. In the meantime, 
I suggest you familiarize yourself with this facility. It is our best option for a base of operations. And you can make use of its equipment to improve your ability to override machines. She got um, caught up. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that, that sounds good. Shall I grant access to your companions? They will be here shortly. Um... Okay, but... Don't overwhelm them, okay? They don't have a lot of experience with things like... Well... You. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She's like, it's like kind of like meeting mom for the first time for her, for Aloy, kind of. You know, kind of. Uh, so no fake this time? No. This time she's real. Borl, so this is Gaia. Hello. Hi. Hi. Gaia's still, uh, waking up. Let's look around. I will highlight the location of the lab on your focus. Okay. I'm pretty, I was pretty sure Varl was going to have a breakdown. I have established a network between your focuses. Oh, shoot. Allowing you to communicate a base? I got a base? Good. So what was this place? A regional control center where Zero Dawn progeny would have overseen terraforming operations in the area. She definitely looks asleep. Oh my gosh. Did we act? I didn't think we were actually gonna be able to do it. Are we gonna actually be able to like get all the subordinate functions in this game and like bring them all together? Cause that would be dope. Also, I hope Minerva's doing better. Poor thing. Oh my gosh. What's all this? This was intended as the main gathering space for control center operatives. You could fit a good number of people in here. Or maybe just a few. To start with, you two go ahead. I'm going to poke around. She's having a moment. Elevator. Um, something else. So this, I get, I get to have a base in this game, and my friends are going to be in here. So this place was here all this time, built for people who would never show up. But, Why didn't they? but now my friends... Remember that guy I told you about? Ted Farrow? <gasps> he... sabotaged things. It wasn't supposed to be this way. So this was supposed to be... a lab. That was its intended purpose. Some of the machine data you recovered from the repair bay below us appears to be corrupted. Accessing the terminal in this room will show you how to repair and complete the override. Oh, I'll take a look. Okay. Uh -huh. Ooh, craft this override to unlock the ability to override them. What are you saying? that I have technically unlocked the overrides but I have to unlock them again because they're damaged that is absolute garbage oh. looks like I need data from machine parts to fix the corrupted I'm override. actually pissed about that my initialization is complete you may continue to explore the facility Ayla. oh thank you when you are ready, return to the control room. We have much to discuss. We certainly do. This would have been an access point for advanced training modules on terraforming operations. Unfortunately, those modules were deleted when the Apollo database was destroyed. That's too bad. Look at him interacting with the environment. So I will be able to do this stuff, though, because we're going to get a copy of Apollo back. No, no doubts about it. If we got what's this space Minerva, for? this would have been the sleeping quarters for control center operatives. Reminds me of the bedhouse aspirants had to sleep in the night before the proving. 
It doesn't look very comfy. Yeah, there's a, again, through the wall, I'm seeing some stuff hidden in the corners. A bathroom. This is place, this place is not doing well. Hey, Gaia? Why doesn't this door have power? You haven't unlocked it yet. At my current operating level, I am only able to restore functionality to part of this facility. In time, that may change. Got it. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna upgrade my base. Looks like an office. Correct. The facility was designed with a number of private offices. This is so weird. I guess it's nice to have a space to call your own. It's so weird to see, like, people dressed like Aloy and Varl and everyone wandering around these office spaces. Mm. Through that door is a trail that leads towards Plainsong. Oh. So I could head back east if I need to, once we're done here. Correct. I need to poke all these rooms so that I can... see... what... They do did I Where does this one go? That door leads to the West Exit. Oh. But before you leave, we have much to discuss. Going further right. Further west. Okay, it's good. Let's go. I think we're good. Okay. Maybe it's time to talk to Gaia. Or, I'll leave you too. Are, are we what, really you're not gonna come with me? This is so weird. Why wouldn't you wanna come with me? Did I not? Wait, wait, wait. Did I not explore the base totally? Back already? Listen. I might want to look around more first. I'll come with you then. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. There was a couple rooms, I think, that didn't get... Looks like another office. Yeah. If no one's ever been here, who built all this? Gaia did. With the help of machines. I thought humans did. Like, the earlier humans did. Oh, this is the way I came in. Oh, okay. Like, the way I tried to come in earlier. Wait, oh, that means, potentially, this stuff has opened up. Right. Ooh, nice. Ancient metal eye. Looks like some kind of storage room. What's all this stuff for? This facility was designed to process an immense amount of data from the terraforming system. Uh, this is where it would have been stored. Here. Aloy, you have now hey, I did it. all accessible <laughs> rooms of the facility. There you are. Should we keep looking why around? Don't, why don't you just come with me? You can crawl just as well as anybody else can. Oh, I've been down here before. That's where I first got into the now facility. Now you say that. What? Hi, sort of mom. Hello, Aloy. Uh, hi. <laughs> so you're ready? Yes. Initialization is complete. I can't believe we got her back. All tests show that my heuristic matrix launched correctly and is stable. You must have many questions. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But two big ones first. No, I didn't. Uh, I was, I mean, I, mm, I wasn't sure we were going to get Guy back in this one. Like, at least be able to talk to her. This is so weird. We're not going to be able to fix the biosphere without making you whole. I ran a search for your subfunctions at the Hades Proving Lab, but Minerva was the only one I found. Thankfully, the sensory capabilities of this facility are far more advanced. I will search for the others now. Transmitting query pattern. 
Oh boy. Can we just call them all back? Of Apollo, Artemis, and Eleuthia, I can find no trace. They are simply gone. What about the others? Ether, Demeter, and Poseidon are revealed. They lie within reach, procurable. Hades, though. And Hephaestus? Oh, that's Hephaestus. It too stands revealed. But it is not like the others. <laughs> That's for sure. In the years since the extinction signal, Hephaestus has evolved. Moreover, it is not confined to a single location. It haunts the global network that connects cauldrons to each other across the planet, making it exceptionally difficult to subdue. Let me guess. We need it bad? Correct. Its capabilities are essential. Without it, I can only delay the extinction of life on Earth. Hephaestus is our only hope of a permanent solution. He is the mostly... So we start there? ...terraforming function. Unfortunately, we cannot. Procuring Hephaestus can only be attempted after my own capabilities have been significantly enhanced. Grab the other subordinate functions first, then Hephaestus. Precisely so. So, Ether, Demeter, and Poseidon. How do I capture water? To agriculture. A function, you will have to travel to its location and something else. And find the physical processor to which it escaped. Then, exactly as you did with Minerva, you must use the master override to revert the subordinate function to its original code state. And then, how do I get it back here? The subordinate function must be loaded onto a data storage device. And physically carried back to this facility. Really? We can't just use the cloud. We probably don't really have a cloud. But the Hephaestus your root kernel was stored Hephaestus on? has a cloud. Yes. Its capacity is limited. Oh of course. So it can only carry one subordinate function at They a time. are pretty big. But in all other respects, it will suffice. This is kind of archaic, but you know. Maybe you can help me make sense of something. These guys have a Apollo. Ago, I had a run-in with a group of strangers. They have Apollo. They tried to kill me. They had machine servitors and a um, uh, a clone of Elizabeth Sobek with them. Yes, this was recorded by your focus. Do you know who they are? I thought we crushed the that focus, that by the way. The question is related to the extinction signal that woke Hades, prompting my predecessor's self-destruction. The extinction signal? Okay, that sounds ominous. The signal did not come from Earth. I knew it didn't. Oh my gosh, it's Odyssey. But it appears to have originated 81 trillion kilometers away. That's not a light year. So it's got to be within the, the system. So Dang it. <laughs> light itself requires 8.611 I'm years to cross. Just going to shut up. <laughs> so it's really far away. Okay, so What's so far away, and and why does it want us dead? Is it Odyssey? The Sirius Star System. <gasps> that's where they went. But that's where Far Zenith, their ship. The Odyssey. They survived. Yes, I knew that's it. That's where it was headed. But it blew up. I knew it. I must. I knew it. I don't. Mm -hmm. Why make it seem like they failed? They didn't want anyone else to know. To follow them. They didn't want anyone to know. Mm -hmm. They didn't want future humans to think that they were out there. Wait. The strangers who tried to kill me at the Hades Proving Lab? The ones with the clone? Are you saying that they're from... That they're descendants of... No, Farsi. No, they're the actual people. Yes, that is my conclusion. I'm pretty sure.
Because they knew about Elizabeth Sobek and stuff. I guess their predecessors could have told them. Anyway, I thought the fact that she used kilometers indicated that it wouldn't be a light year, that you would use light year to indicate that. Maybe I'll just edit all that out so you don't have to hear me being an idiot. But we'll see. <laughs> but I, for, I thought, I assumed that they were actually still kind of floating out nearby. Just out, like, in, not in the Earth's atmosphere, but like, in like the space station orbiting in like the proximity to earth that they hadn't gotten that far but they got there they got out there oh boy the three subordinate functions that you detected what do we know about them all three are relevant to problems currently plaguing the biosphere oh Either air is responsible for detoxifying the atmosphere and moderating the weather Poseidon controls the organic and chemical composition of water resources. Demeter sows, fertilizes, and tends to plant life. If all three were restored to me, they would constitute a massive increase to my heuristic processing density. But beware. Their responses to my query pattern were... irregular. In human terms, they are frightened, lost, and paranoid. Like Minerva. They need to be whole again. Exactly. Mm. The missing subordinate functions. What can you tell me about that? I don't want to hear about Apollo. I'm going to cry. Artemis rewilded the Earth with a variety of animal species. Eleuthia was responsible for gestating, nurturing, oh. and culturing a new generation of human So beings. her job's kind of done. Apollo was tasked with preserving, organizing, and disseminating vast archives of human knowledge and cultural achievements. I will never not. Unfortunately, mm, no. all archived Apollo data was purged on the 2nd of February, 2066, by order of Ted Farrow. Farrow, huh? Mm. I really hate that guy. I really hate that guy. He appears to have been pathologically narcissistic, impulsive, and unstable. Yeah, mm -hmm. and rich, mm. dangerous combination. All three of the missing functions have already served their Not purpose, Apollo. or were prevented from doing so. Do you still need them? If attainable, yes. Restoring their remaining elements would increase my heuristic processing density. Unfortunately, I have no way to track them. They have disappeared without a trace. I don't know. I know we'll get a copy of Apollo because that has been mentioned in the Far Zenith archives that they got a copy of Apollo. So we'll get that back. We'll freaking get that back. <laughs> um, uh, the other two, though, I don't know. Artemis would be nice to get back. The other one, we don't necessarily need. And I will have to cut it off there because this episode was going to be really long, about an hour long, if I didn't cut it in half. So we have to cut the lore dump in half, but it's super cool. There's definitely more to come in the next episode, so I hope you guys are ready for that, because I sure am. I'm excited to play this game again in an environment where I can actually talk at my normal volume. It's going to be great, so... Uh, thank you all again for watching. I really appreciate it. Really, like, really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to specifically my sapling tier patron, Reese Galito. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special thank you to Christopher, my tree tier patron, who's the super bestest, and I really appreciate all your support. Thank you all again for watching, and hope to see you in the next one.